Welcome back to Midday. We are talking about a really fun fundraiser that's coming up that I think is going to help everybody with their spring cleaning. Uh, we have Roxana Ferguson. She doesn't have your travel deals today. I'm sorry. We've already done that this week. Roxana is wearing her other hat today. And of course, that's Daybreak Rotary. Uh, thanks for being here, Roxana. We also have Bev Warner joining us as well, who's sitting right beside me. Um, we appreciate you ladies being here. We, we want to talk a little bit about what this uh, fundraiser is. Art from the Attic is what it's called. And I know it's not happening until the fall, but we're telling people about it right now for a specific reason. And Bev, I'll start with you. Why do we want people to know about this now? Because we want you to uh, clean out your closets, clean out your basements, or maybe yeah. you're deciding to downsize or move. And if you have any art that you no longer are going to be hanging, we're asking you to donate it to us and we'll get it all ready for the sale. And Roxana, the sale, what, where will the funds from the sale go? What, what, what is this fundraiser helping? We want to build outdoor living space for seniors. So we're going to start with Overlander uh, Residential Care. They have uh, what should be condemned gazebo right now that is right. not safe for anybody to use. And there are also four hospice beds there. So it would be really nice to have an outdoor space where uh, families could get together um, people living in the in the uh, care facility could have some outdoor space with some fresh air. So our funds from this sale will start off with Overlander, and if we are a huge success and we can do it, we'll we'll do the next and the next and the next. But that's seniors and outdoor living spaces are our goal. That's where you're starting. Yeah. So this is the first uh, of its kind. It's a new fundraiser, I guess you could yeah. say, to Kamloops. Um, so yes, if you're spring cleaning or downsizing, as Bev, Bev mentioned, make sure you think about that. Um, Let's talk a little bit about um, the process and how this works. So if somebody is cleaning out uh, and finds some beautiful art pieces that they want to donate, what happens then? Do you come pick them up? I mean, what's the process behind everything? We have five drop-off spots in Kamloops. It's uh, TravelWise, Portfolio Interiors, Kamloops Insurance by London Drugs, the North Shore Business Association, and Smith Chevrolet up on Notre Dame. So you can bring it into any one of those places mm -hmm. at any time and, and they'll accept them. Uh, you can go to our Facebook page and uh, we have our information on there and my contact information is on there. So it's, if you can't get it to us, we'll try and come to you and yeah. get it, just give me a shout. And and if you're wondering if it's the right kind of thing to give, give me a call. Okay, so the sale is happening October 4th and 5th. Um, we'll, we'll put that information up on the screen for you in a moment. Right here we have some beautiful pieces that you ladies brought in. Is this just an example of some of the things that will be at the sale? There will be everything from what I will call, maybe not, well, Walmart art, winner's art yeah. too. Yeah. Yeah. Um, my mom is an artist and as you know, we t chatted about some of your coworkers that are, <laughs> are very talented. Yeah. So we'll have um, new art from uh, different artists of different levels. So we're any two dim dimensional art. We're not in a position where we can take pottery and because you know, that's art yeah. as well. But yeah. any art that will go on a wall, somebody called me the other day and has, um, framed posters from the 40s and she said yeah. will you take it and I said absolutely wow, that's I can't wait to see it yeah um, so yes anything what isn't uh, loved by us anymore will certainly I was over at Bev's the other <laughs> night and she had some art there that we were taking pictures of I go I just want that picture yeah I, I, I you know it doesn't need to go to the sale I'll just buy it now yeah, yeah exactly and that's the thing so. right I think that's uh, that's what what people can think about when they're cleaning out their mm -hmm. It doesn't yeah. have to be your attic, but whatever <laughs> room in your house it is, uh, exactly. that somebody else might really love that piece that, that you have had for quite some time. Um, why start with helping seniors, ladies? I mean, is that, did you see that need right away? Is that where, why you're starting there? We started there because um, my husband and I volunteer there. We could see some needs mm -hmm. that were being fulfilled. And when we talked to them about it, there's gaps in funding, like there is a lot of things. And uh, so I brought it back to Rotary and said, this is something that's needed and we like to help seniors and youth and so it fits right in with our mandate. Yeah, and that's exactly it, Roxana. That's what Rotary does, uh, really just out there helping everyone in the community. And we're all getting older. Yes, it's true. So, that, that it's is true. That's the truth. <laughs> Not being selfish, but you know. <laughs> well, I mean, you do have to think we'll about that. We'll build beautiful spaces, so then we're, when we get there, we'll you know go look. Our you know, yeah, it all came together for us. Yeah, yeah. that's exactly yeah. right. Excellent. Well, thank you, ladies, for joining us. We're going to have you on, of course, a few more times before the actual sale takes place. But it is October fourth and fifth. There's a, there's Bev's phone number there on the screen. Yeah. You can get a hold of her if you need to. Art from the attic is going to be a, a really great.
great sale. Make sure that you're thinking about that when you're spring cleaning this season and uh, you can help out uh, seniors at Overlanders and of course our community in general. We're back in two minutes on Midday. Stay with us.